Hello, my name is Molly Grunwald of Molly Grunwald Photography. I'm here today to show you guys how I simplified my process of building blog posts using Narrative Publish. Now, Narrative Publish completely changed the game for me. Blogging was something that completely terrified me, as I'm sure it is doing the same for most of you. So, Narrative Publish actually helped me transform the way how I do things and helps me create blog posts in less than 10 minutes, so follow along. We're gonna go to the top and create new post. For tutorial purposes, I'm just gonna name that tutorial, find the folder, and create. And we are in. We have all the photos on the left-hand side that we imported. On the right, we have a lot of SEO type stuff that I will get into. So I wanna show you quickly the super awesome like auto layout wizard tool. All you do is click this cute little star. The arrow to the right, you can choose how many images. So if you wanna do auto layout the entire thing with all of your photos, you would click all. We'll just do 12 to show you. Press this and it magically puts in all these images in a super cute auto layout. I usually like to manually do it, so we'll undo that really quick and I'll show you. So you can double tap, um, and this is a super cool way to manually and like custom create um, what your blog will look like. First, we'll get into SEO image description. This is super important, so like let's just do Detroit Bride. And this is something I would do on every single photo. SEO is search engine optimization. So this is gonna make sure that we have all of these keywords inputted into your blog before you publish them. So it'll be perfect for Google and for the web. So for SEO focused keywords, this is focused keywords that are gonna help describe what this blog post is. So we're gonna do Detroit wedding sailboat elopement. Um, you'll want to make your blog title, you know, describe a little better than tutorials. So we'll maybe do the same kind of thing. What's cool is all of these give you like a red, yellow, green light system to let you know like, okay, we're good to go. There's also a text block that this SEO feedback says that you want to do. I usually do my text through WordPress, but that is where this comes in. So you can drag and drop text right here and just kind of do it in other sections. So maybe you would be describing what's happening here. Give a little story. This is a like blank space, like padding. This is where you can do like download images. I don't ever really do that. But so again, some really unique things. If I was typing in, obviously some words right here, we would get that green light. Say this is all good to go. I have all my images that I want to blog. I'm going to go over to publish. I publish directly to WordPress. So I always do it as like a draft, but if you're publishing as a final thing, you'll unmark it as draft. So animation is super cool. I always like to do this one. I'll show you when I show you the final blog. These let it fade in or like slide in. Lightbox is cool. It's when your visitors are like on your blog and they hold down on one, it will pull up into full screen. Super unique feature. I always, always, always include Pinterest buttons. This is super good for um, your Pinterest SEO. You can be pinning directly from your site. Visitors on your blog can be pinning directly from your website. And then you can adjust like, you know, where you want it. But I just do small buttons on the left and it works out perfectly. So when you are all ready to go, you'll just click publish. I will go to my blog to show you what it looks like. So this is all stuff that I wrote in WordPress. But here you go. This is the blog. Love how unique it can be. It Seriously, it looks like I spent a ton of time doing this. See how the images like slide up too? So this is the fun animation feature. I'm just obsessed with how simple narrative makes this process. Blogging can be so overwhelming and this just literally streamlines this process. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching. I hope this helps you guys. Um, shoot me a message if you have any other questions.